is breastfeeding the magic bullet to postpartum weight loss. So if you are a mom, a postpartum mom, that is a new mom, you just had a baby, maybe the first baby, second baby, third baby, even fourth baby, you've had a lot of people say, even at the hospital, that when you start breastfeeding, all this weight is going to just melt away and it's going to go away. But is this really the case? So my name is Nastery and I help moms like you transition easily into postpartum by helping them uh, overcome the most overwhelming postpartum challenges such as this one. So uh, in this case scenario, we are talking about breastfeeding. So breastfeeding, talking as a nurse, it is a very good way of burning calories. This is because it burns about 300 to 500 calories every day when you breastfeed on demand. And when we say about breastfeeding on demand, we mean that you're breastfeeding about 8 to 12 times a day. Not every a mom with pattern is able to breastfeed uh, this many number of times because breastfeeding comes with, with its own set of issues. issues. So there are latching lacking. issues. There's some moms complain they don't have enough breast milk. You know, a lot of things. You no know, work coming between. You know, there's a lot of things that may affect breastfeeding. So I would say that to some women, breastfeeding may actually help to lose weight but to others it may not lift a needle it may not do anything and this is um the number one reason why so the number one reason why this fitting is really not the best magic bullet to postpartum weight loss is that weight loss is because uh for breastfeeding to occur, there's a hormone called prolactin. So prolactin is a, is a hormone that is, that is responsible for milk production. And this hormone actually causes us even to eat more, to store more fat so that we can be able to support breastfeeding. So in as much as you are breastfeeding on demand, sometimes we also find ourselves eating more because of this hormone. So it may not be the best way to lose weight postpartum you also need to incorporate other 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 things you also need to do a few other things so that you can support your body holistically for example can you support your ghrelin hormone the hormone responsible for uh feeling hungry the hormone responsible for feeling full that is the leptin hormone can you also regulate your insulin so that you are not storing a lot of fat instead of burning it so I uh, have this guide that I've created specifically for you so that you can be able to balance all of these hormones in your body so that you are not just eating and craving and storing fat because of the hormones. Not because you are not exercising, not because you, know, you are not doing all of these fitness things that your fitness instructor is telling you, but because you are, your hormones are out of hot. So I want you to get this guide learn how you can support these uh, for hormones the prolactin uh, the leptin the gradient and the insulin so that you can be able to effortlessly uh, lose weight over time and the one thing that i want you to take note of is remember you gain this weight over a period of nine months so you should also give your body the same amount of time for ample recovery because when you rush postpartum uh, when you rush recovery, postpartum recovery, you may get some complications such as there are some women, you'll hear them complaining about low back pains, even months after giving birth. This is because the postpartum recovery didn't take place well. There are others who will have issues uh, such as, you know, they're having painful intercourse, they have urine leakages. So those are all things that you should take care of postpartum to recover and i've included all of this in this guide so it is a very holistic guide it is going to help you out in this most overwhelming postpartum challenges including this one that we are talking about so i want you to have it today actually about 88 moms get this guide daily so that should tell you that how just just how valuable it is and it's gonna help you out in this journey postpartum so before you go i want you to watch this other video right here because 
these videos i don't know whether it will help you here so watch this other video here because it's gonna help you out even more